Hi guys, it's Inka. So an artisanal ice cream shop in LA has invited me over to make two really unique ice cream flavors with them, which if I succeed, they might sell. So let's find out. I am on my way to the airport right now and I'll see you guys in LA. Hi, I'm Adrienne Borlongan. I'm one of the co-founders of Wanderlust Creamery. We're an artisanal ice cream shop. We make everything in-house and all of our flavors are inspired by travel. Today we're having Inga coming to make some ice cream. It's gonna be really fun. I'm finally here. I wanted to do something today that kind of represents my background. I'm half Taiwanese and I'm half Hong Kong Chinese. All the best desserts come from Yes! Here. Hong Kong egg tarts are so popular. That custard flavor. I put in some shards of flaky caramelized puff oh pastry. That sounds so good. Oolong tea is super big in Taiwan. My mom would always buy pineapple pastries. Ooh, maybe we can do an oolong infused ice cream with some pineapple pastry pieces in there. Let's do it! We're gonna start with our base. Organic grass-fed dairy, eggs, a little bit of sugar. For this one, we're using 16% butter fat because we want it a little richer. This looks super creamy. We're gonna add some Taiwanese oolong. I picked this variety because it's known for having like a really buttery, milky flavor. I love that. We're just gonna heat that until it infuses. Look at this, swirly. Basically bringing the base to just a low simmer. Oh, yeah, you right. can actually smell the... This is so cool. And now we're gonna take this and strain it. Y'all ready? Oh my God. You can actually see this many tea leaves in there. I yep. love it. We did it. Press down really hard on that. Squeeze it all out. Is it coming out? Oh my God. Okay. Do you want to taste your concoction? Yes. Ooh. It tastes like really creamy boba tea. It's not bitter. This is so good. I would just oh. eat it like this. Oh. We're gonna cut up our pineapple pastry. Pure pineapple goodness. Now that we have the oolong tea already done, uh -huh. we're gonna set that one aside and we're gonna okay. start with our Hong Kong egg tart ice cream. We're gonna separate some egg yolks. <laughs> okay, there we go. Egg whites in here. Yes. Wow, I am really bad at this today. Yes. Oh. Sorry, sorry, okay. sorry, sorry. <gasps> oh, I'm definitely... No. <laughs> I'm sorry. I have a spoon. Don't worry. I did it. Beautiful. We're adding our base again. We're adding extra egg yolks to make it... Extra yolky. Let's heat this baby up. Break it up. This is pretty much warm. I'm just gonna put a little splash. Beautiful color and then you're gonna add that to this. Does that smell familiar to you? That does. <laughs> to give it more egg flavor, uh -huh. we're using this Indian ingredient called black salt. This is labeled egg farts. It's literally labeled egg farts because it smells like egg farts. Smell it. Okay, yeah, it does smell like yeah. <laughs> This is what they use to make vegan eggs. It gives it more of that egg flavor without adding actual egg. You don't want it tasting too much like farts. Yeah. If we add too much egg, it's gonna ruin the consistency oh. of the ice cream. Cheers. Cheers. Mm. Mm. Super eggy. It tastes exactly like egg tart, like a creamier, eggier version of it. Only thing missing is the crust. I baked up some sticks of puff pastry so that when you scoop, these kind of just break. Ooh. And yes. you can see the flakes. Custard and then pastry exactly. and then like a never ending egg tart. So now we're gonna go ahead and pour this mix into the ice cream machine. Okay, let's go. This is a Ferrari of ice cream machines. This is the Carpeggiani LB502G. Car Carpeggiani Lamborghini. We pour the mix in here and the mix gets whipped with a blade as the barrel freezes the ice cream, creating super tight microscopic ice crystals. Got it. Oh my god. This is some epic egg tart waterfall right here. <laughs> to the very last drop. Put the lid on and I'm gonna have you press the magic button. Here we go. In eight minutes, we'll come back. I'm gonna open the gate. Okay, open the gate. Oh! Oh my god. This is like a, what, what game is this? Like Tetris? <laughs> Oh 
almost four gallons. Just stick them in and they're gonna get broken up all the way down. Fill that baby up. Yeah. And then let's just cover them up. Oh yeah. We're gonna cover this with some paper. We're just gonna throw it right here in our blast freezer. Yeah. We're gonna let it sit for about 15 minutes. We did it. First ice cream check. All right, now let's do the long ice cream. Round two. Yeah, I'm scared. Okay, go, 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 go! Oh, 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 oh. <laughs> this is giving me a panic attack. Oh my goodness. So now we keep on waiting. All right, let's peel back this oolong ice cream with pineapple pastry bits. Oolong. Oolong. Woo. Woo. There you go. Ta-da. Smells like pineapple. <laughs> but now we should do one of this and then one of the egg custard. This is the Hong Kong egg tart. Look at how the puff pastry breaks apart. I'm so excited. This is me in ice cream form. A little bit of this, a little bit of that. I love the oolong flavor. Get the creaminess of the custard. It reminds me of home. This is amazing. We did it! Yay! So if you guys want to eat this too, you should go to Wanderlust Creamery right now because it's only going to be there for a short while. I promise you, it will be worth the trip. So <laughs> Hey, Unsolved is on a new channel, and now your part. Subscribe, Subscribe here. here. That was my part.